Hey guys, so, well today I'm going to, as you see here, I'm going to do a compression test on my Echo PB251 leaf blower. So I've had this blower for five years and the compression is still as good as it was when I bought it five years ago. And so I thought I'll do a compression test to see how good the compression is. So first what we're going to need to do is we got to pull the spark plug out. If I can get it out. There we go. And then we'll insert our compression tester in okay now we only want to just get this thing hand tight just snug enough because you don't want to tighten it up too much because you could damage that rubber o-ring that is on it okay so I'll try to get my tripod positioned so y'all can be able to see the tester while I uh, pull over the engine and whenever you uh, do pull it over make sure you have the throttle squeezed wide open all right so that's probably about as good as I'm gonna get it so y'all aren't gonna be able to see that very well so I have the engine have it have the throttle squeeze wide open so I'm going to just pull it until the needle will stop moving and as you can see here that's about 120 psi so that's actually not bad for a leaf blower that's five years old so, pretty good. Alright, so now I'll take the compression tester off. Alright, and then reinsert the spark plug. All right, cool. So that's the compression test on the Echo PB251. And so I will do a, a compression test on all of my other lawn equipments as well. And so I uh, hope you all enjoyed this video. And so thanks for watching.